Okay, so here we have a 710. The 710, uh, the specific model is the 710 MS. Um, and the MS is for Microsoft, no surprise. And that means that it's certified for Teams and for Skype for business. And that means that the hang up, uh, the disconnect and hang up buttons work. Um, yeah, so it's a great product. Now, this has a kickstand, which you don't have to use. Most people probably won't. Um, on the back is a little Bluetooth dongle you can just pop out and that Bluetooth dongle can go straight into a PC, but you don't need to. Um, if you uh, choose not to, uh, you might want to tape that in so that people don't take it. Now let's see the most interesting part of this. Um, in addition to the microphone at the bottom, there's a single microphone here, and the speaker being much better than their predecessors, and their predecessors were pretty good, you will find that the, um, um, uh, the coolest feature of this whole thing is that you can pair these two things together. Uh, and we'll do that in just a moment. Actually, let's just do it now. So what you do is just press the power button and press the little link icon at the bottom here. By the way, I've had no setup, no configuration. This is it. Power it on. Press the link button. Linked. Link. There we go. Let's check the volume mode on this. So, and we'll show you how uh, when these are paired, how well this works. So. <laughs> That's being driven off of a PC right now. And you can see when I adjust one, that they're both being adjusted, uh, which is a nice little feature. So that means you don't have to run around in a border. Here are the technical specs for the Jabber Speak 710. Uh, and connectivity wise, uh, Bluetooth 4.2 is specified here. And uh, wireless range, about 100 feet. Uh, we haven't tested this, but it's gone for really quite a distance. We had some trouble recording the Jabra 710 uh, in a way that you'd be able to differentiate the difference between it and other devices. But we found that on their website, on the Jabra website, they had some pretty good examples that really were representative of the quality difference. So we're just going to play those right now. In a conference call, everyone should be able to hear and understand what is being said. So it is as good as being face to face. And with several people in a meeting room, it is important to use equipment that delivers superior audio quality at the right sound. So you get an idea. The sound quality really is substantially better. So the 710 uh, over, uh, I looked at the uh, Foxbox, the uh, Polycom, um, what was it called? The uh, Callista. They're fine, but this is better. If you have any questions or concerns, please get a hold of us at www.urtech.ca. Bye-bye.